Could you first start off by telling us how you got involved with the movie? I auditioned. I went. I went. Uh, I got a call from my agent, and I auditioned for the for the movie. And then they, Martin Lawrence, saw the tape, and he liked it. And then he gave me. He gave me. The, they gave me the role. Did you have to audition as a guy or a girl? I, it's both. <laughs> they want to see if I can rap, but they had me rapping as the girl. And the guy, it was weird, man. It was just, it was weird because they didn't have the full fat suit on there, so it was just, it was, it was really, it was really drag. You know what I'm saying? It was a drag. <laughs> nice. Did you have to wear a wig for the audition or anything, or was it just? Yeah, but it wasn't the fat suit. So just, just, yeah, it was wig weird. And whiskers. It was like Tootsie, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Dustin Hoffman. It was just without the prosthetics. <laughs> nice. So what did you think the first time you saw yourself as Sean? I was like, damn, I don't, I don't know if she's ugly or pretty. I can't. Some people are like, uh, oh, she's ugly. Some people are like she's pretty. So I. I don't know which one. I don't. I, I was just like, wow. I look like my mom, kind of. But my mom is hot. But yeah, I don't know what this is. It's a weird. It's a weird thing. So how sort of difficult is it to to act in heels and drag? Uh, it's tough. And all my brothers are making fun of me at home. They're like, dog, you done lost it now. You really <laughs> lost it. This is yeah, yeah, man. You, yeah, yeah. I thought you was from Detroit. I thought you was from Detroit, dog. So now, I guess uh, yeah. Yep. Uh, and how uncomfortable was it? Uh, it was, I broke two of the heels. Oh, really? Two of them. <laughs> I was running, trying to do action. It's one thing to do action as a guy, but doing action as, 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 as a girl was really, really crazy. So uh, can you just talk a little about working with uh, Martin as well? Working with Martin is, uh, was a, a pleasure. He, he's, he's probably, if not the best comedian, you know, just like of, of, of our time. I mean, I mean, as far as acting, I mean, you know, him and Eddie Murphy are just like, it's a blessing to be able to put on some prosthetics at, at such a young age, you know? You've mentioned that he was a bit of an icon to you. Uh, why is he, why does he stand out? What, and what well, did you from, learn from him? Well, from You So Crazy and and, and from, uh, like, I just relate to him, you know what I'm saying? From all, all his stuff that he's done, I mean, Bad Boys and, 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 and how can you, he's, I can go on. Uh, Shanae, all his characters, everything that he's done has been amazing. And so what did you learn from him? I learned how to be professional, how to sit down and, and do your job and then kind of just save your energy for the set. Because I would talk a lot and get in trouble for talking too much in, 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 on the set. So they was like, yo, man, you just got to chill out, be cool, be calm. And, and, and that's what I learned, how to be more of a professional. I have a habit of just talking like I'm doing now. <laughs> See that? You're talking. Um, <laughs> what about the, uh, there's a sort of teen element to the movie. It's more geared towards teens now. Can you just talk about that and who's? Yeah, I think they wanted to bring bring in like some, a fresh new, like, 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 like a uh, teenage feeling. You know what I mean? It, it, it's just something that, like with the hip hop and all the, all this, the, the, the uh, rapping and the action is something that, that you can do. And everyone, when I was, when I was, when I was uh, 17, I ran away from home to become, to get in movies. So I, this character I really relate to. And, and that's something that I think every teenager has that problem when they, with, they, with their parents. It's like, do I want to be in, 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 do I want to do what my father wants me to do? Or do I want to do what, what, uh, what I want to do? And he chose to do what he wanted to do. But at the same time, he had to, pay the cost. You want to be the boss, you got to pay the cost to be the boss. So that's what it is. And there's a big musical element to the movie as well with you rapping, as you mentioned. Yeah. Have you got any sort of musical aspirations? No. <laughs> no. Why not? No. No, I suck. You know, I, I'm good in the movie, but in real life, I suck. You really? know, I, yeah, I'm not. I'm a comedian. That's that's my true talent. But I'm happy that I learned to rap. If, if Maybe I can do an album and, and maybe it can flop, you know, but I tried. I signed the cash money and become a cash money all-star and then sell them no records. <laughs>